Hi to my voice family. Today we'll be following up on our topic on feminism and I had the chance to interview some males on the topic and I'd like you to hear what they had to say so stay tuned. Gender equality. All human beings are equal in the sight of God. A man is equal to a woman. A woman or a, a girl child is equal to a boy child. But when we talk about the gender equality, um, it is com- or it's coming from the background where women were looked down upon by men by probably uh, either misinterpreting or deliberately writing on scriptures that empowered man to have authority over a, man, over, over a woman. Like in Genesis after the fall. Yes. Can explain. Sure, I'm saying Gen- gender equality. All human beings are equal in the sight of God. A man is equal to a woman. A woman or a, a girl child is equal to a boy child. So, but when we talk about gender equality, um, it is com- or it's coming from the background where women were looked down upon by men, by probably uh, either misinterpreting or deliberately writing on scriptures that empowered man to have authority over a man over a, over a woman like in genesis after the fall a god said he shall rule over you meaning a man shall rule over a woman but you know taking it from the principle of rulership god did not mean that a man was going to ride over a woman or dominate a woman no our dominion was over the earth and the principle of dominion was given when when eve was in adam you know in genesis chapter 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 one chapter two chapter one and chapter two that's before the fall before even uh, uh, eve comes into existence mm-hmm. so gender equality in the face of uh, uh human rights now the gender equality that we're looking at in the face of human rights human rights now have taken things to extremes where the principles of marriage have been have been uh, looked down upon or have been trodden over by equality what they, what they are calling so called equality you know and when we go into the interest of it those are movements that start by probably women who have been disappointed by their men and they try to take a general a general trend that is it's like every woman in the world has been disappointed by a, a man that's the way they look at it so they bring it in gender equality in, in terms of protecting a woman because if they are looking at gender equality i have re- rights as a man and uh, if they are looking at gender equality it means i should not also be mistreated by my wife mm. but if we look at what is being put up it's like it's only a man who mistreats a woman it's only a girl who needs to be taken to school what about the boy you know it's like a boy is already paid for by parents the government has come in to pay for a, for a girl to help a girl find a, find a, a job help a girl do this what about the boy you know so if it's the, the word is equality it's the having a or maybe an equal space in the economic affairs or in the in the in the platforms that are existing where a man and a woman have you know, a common space yeah. where both can express themselves equally. So, to me, modern gender equality, it's not gender equality, it's feminism. It's more of feminism because it's support of a feminine gender than a support of a, a male. So, uh, and that is out. In church, we cannot tolerate that because we do not preach equality as, as, as a feminism, no. We we preach equality as the scriptures put it. Mm-hmm. says we, we shall all inherit the kingdom of God. On the other hand, Peter says, treat her as a weaker sex. You know, meaning a woman is weaker. Definitely we are not the same. Masculine and, masi- and, and fem- mm-hmm. feminines, we are not the same. Mm-hmm. You know, masculines are stronger. Mm-hmm. So that's the way we look at things. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So in view of the things that have been said, I'd like to hear your contributions towards it so that we can see if we need another video to scrutinize more or have more interviews. I'm looking forward to your feedback. And also, I have added a link 
to a book that I think all feminists should read, even if you don't agree with me or you agree with me but want to understand more. I, I'm going to um, link the book that I've been reading that's been giving me an understanding of feminism. I'll put it in the description and read it and tell me what you think. It's not a very long book, so if you're able to finish it soonest, you can come back and comment on this on this video. Thank you so much.